In now, Simon Michelle from Fig Securities to get more on the bond markets and how they're sort of reacting in the in the lead up to the Brexit vote on Thursday night. And Simon, what are you seeing in terms of global yields? Because they were up slightly, but we are still seeing obviously these mixed polls. Absolutely. So I think uh, you know we had such a big reaction last week in grid when we saw investors really fly to safety and huge demand for bonds pushing those yields down. That's been reversed, and really I think as the polls have looked a little bit more risk, uh, mixed, as you say, and the Remain vote looks uh, you know increasing more likely. Um, investors have been happy to sort of reverse those positions back out of bonds and we're seeing that reflected in uh, equity markets for example. So pull back but look very cautious leading into that vote at the end of the week. What about here at home? I mean in terms of Aussie yields they're sort of reacting to different things at the moment. Obviously the RBA minutes for one and, and Guy Bell's speech this morning. That's right. So we had um, the RBA minutes and look they were pretty upbeat really. I think the only real concern that the RBA mentioned or, or, or mentioned specifically was the lower inflation. That's likely to, re to remain low. They also said markets suggesting the US Fed you know later this year so July is not looking too likely if you look at pricing at the moment uh, so pretty upbeat really and uh, certainly no real uh, cause for a further a rate cut at this point they certainly uh, didn't uh, leave that on the table so that's pretty positive and we also saw as you say a speech by Guy Bell, the uh, assistant governor around the uh, bond market liquidity in the bond market uh, we've seen some significant changes there so a good speech there the other thing I just add as well we've had Optus coming out looking like they'll be doing a, a new bond issue they've hmm. got a 300 million Aussie issue maturing in 2018 so the uh, issuance continues yeah I was say is the corporate bond issuance still sort of solid at this point in the market? Very solid in fact the RBA minutes uh, mentioned the large amount mm. of uh, bank issuance we've seen obviously the hybrids yeah. we saw the ANZ do a US dollar hybrid issue QBE did a, a tier two issue uh, this week as well really high strong demand I think the QBE was four times bid so you know really strong demand for corporate debt at the moment especially given where those sovereign yields have drifted lower you know investors want to take advantage of higher yields and they're moving into the corporate sector all right Simon Michelle really interesting thank you very much for joining us thank you Ingrid Simon Michelle there big securities and